Um, okay, so <clears throat> as I said, I am actually going to do another video today. Uh, as again, I haven't made a video in about two or three weeks, and I should fill up my video library or whatever. Uh, so this video would actually be on, uh, even though you might see that there's a rigged character right there, it won't be on rigging a character. It will be on setting up uh, key keyboard shortcuts, custom keyboard shortcuts. Um, for uh, use in Maya, or maybe, yeah, for use in Maya, obviously, because it's a Maya tutorial. And I'll just use, um, I probably won't use this model, I'll just make a new file. Uh, so let's say, so there's a new file, let's go and show our grid here. And it'll just be a quick tutorial here. So, what you want to do here is, Maya has a built in editor for um, keyboard shortcuts. And to find that, all you do is go to Window. Settings and preferences, uh, and then go to uh, hotkey editor. Press that, and this little window comes up here. Let's resize this so it becomes bigger. And uh, the way this is set up here is uh, here's the categories of fu functions that you can choose uh, things for. Here are the commands of those um, categories of functions, basically the functions. And here's the attributes of the, uh, the function that is selected, so it changes when I uh, click something new, <coughs> and here are the what kind of hotkey is on. So, if we would go to uh, see here, show animation UI, so you can still instead of going up here and pressing animation, you can actually just press um, F2 as you can see here. That's F2, that's a button. Um, so, here you can also remove it, you can list all, which if you there were any more, yeah, they will list that, or you can restore it to default. Or you can ass assign a new hotkey, which uh, is what I will go through here. So let's just say that if we go to edit mesh here and um, let's just say add divisions, okay? Uh, so let's say I want add divisions to be on um, F. Uh, I have a pretty big keyboard, so well, a lot of Fs, so function keys. So let's say I want it on F16 here, okay? Uh, so to do that, you go to select add divisions up here, uh, and um, uh, then you <coughs> basically go up here, you press list all, see if there's actually any other ones, and uh, this, these are the uh, unmapped ones and the mapped ones, just to see what buttons do what, um, so, uh, and, um, okay, so to do this, you see, go to assign your hotkey, uh, and here's the key, so all you have to do is press, I believe, F16 here, if we want that, so if, actually, let me just try this out, okay, seemingly, I can't okay here we go. I have a lot of F's here, so uh, I can only choose F twelve. So okay, let's for the for the purpose of this tutorial, let's just choose F twelve. Actually, that's already assigned something. Let's see, something is not assigned. I'm guessing not. So let's just press. Uh, let's map this to uh, the P key. Maybe let's see if that's new. Okay, that won't be because I know it isn't because that's a switch. That's all. Oh, that's a speech letter. Uh, actually, it's on. In, it's it's in very many languages, but whatever. And uh, say you want. Um, you can choose whatever you want here. I just choose this because this isn't assigned to anything at the moment. Uh, so let's say we want um, control and then that key, just to say to hold down control and then press that key where it will work. And um, here let's say press because we just want to press it. We don't want to release it. Uh, so let's say assign. Uh, oh, this isn't valid. Oh, okay. M. No. Uh, okay, here we go. Control M. Okay. Um, so that's the other side. And you can see it popped up here. And if you press it, you can just see all the attributes and things. So if we drag this out, let's just go to our polygon menu here. Uh, let's create a box. And um, press R. And then scale it up big. And press 5 on your keypad to shade it. And let's just try our uh, command here. So let's press Ctrl and M. And what you'll see here is it actually divided it. And you can do this with any real um, function you can have here. So, yeah, that's pretty much the tutorial. It's a very useful uh, function in Maya. And I suggest you try and play with it to um, just experience it. So, yeah, thanks for watching. And I will see you in my next video.